hi friends uh, in this video we are going to solve this right we are going to evaluate this problem so how to evaluate this let's a little bit think right let's think a little bit uh, here this is 73 and this is 17 look some relationships yeah if you add 73 and 17 it will be 0 and then 7 plus 1 it's now 8 and 1 9 90 it means 73 and 17 are the complementary complementary angles right means we have to use complementary angle formula there, there, there must be something right so we have to use uh, that formula here 63 and 70 let me add 63 and 27 right so it's uh, 0 6 plus 2 8 and 1 9 right so again 63 and 27 is also complementary as 73 and 17 was complementary means we must have to use some complementary relationships over here right so let me do first this uh, sine square 73 degree plus sine 17 I can write this like 90 minus 73 also right because uh, 90 minus 73 is equals to 17 since it is a square let me write here square now let's go for the denominator this is cos square 63 cos square 63 degree and another is cos square 27 so cos 27 since it is 27 I can write 90 minus 63 right because 90 minus 63 is also equals to 27 let me write again here square as it is here square right so now sine square 73 sine square 73 degree plus sine 90 minus 63 equals to what we have learned mm, yeah like me right right here sine 90 minus theta is equals to cos theta right we have learned this formula that is why I'm writing this sine 90 minus 73 that is cos 73 right since it is a square so I'm writing a square means sine square 73 plus cos square 73 angle let me do this is cos square 63 right again cos 90 minus 63 and we know we have already learned this cos 90 minus theta equals to sine theta from previous relations right so in cos square 90 minus 63 I am now writing sine square 63 right because it is square that's why it is a square now what you're looking it is something different uh, yeah see here this and this sine square theta plus cos square theta is equals to 1 yeah sine square theta plus cos square theta the first identity that we used uh, that we proved uh, in the previous video right so now we have to use this right sine square theta plus cos square theta equals to 1 here theta is uh, 73 right uh, you can uh, think like that to make easier now I can easily write here 1 and again here cos square 63 you can think as a theta cos square theta plus sine square theta is equals to 1 so like this we have to solve right so in evaluation form so what we have to do we have to just convert uh, the same form of the I mean same form of the trigonometric ratio into another form means I have to convert uh, we have to convert exactly <laughs> right sine into cos or cos into sine uh, means we have to anyhow we have to make sine square plus cos square equals to 1 or in other videos we have to make either sec square minus uh, tan square equals to 1 or it may we have to use cosec square minus cot square equals to 1 so at any cost or anyhow we have to finally make all the problems in this situation means in identical form so we have to convert first all expressions all trigonometric uh, evaluation form everything into express uh, means in identity form trigonometric identity form and we'll be using that identity I'm solving the problem in this whole chapter okay uh, for the more videos, keep watching and okay, bye.